Hey guys, welcome back to Kurosu, and today I'm going to show you how to create some easy x-ray looks inside of After Effects. So without further ado, let's jump right in. So we have some snippets that I've already pulled from Little Yachty's latest music video, which should be a great example to use for this tutorial. So firstly, let's apply a glow effect. Now for this tutorial, I will be using the Deep Glow plugin effect from AE Scripts. However, you can easily follow along by just using the default glow effect. Both will achieve very similar results. I just prefer the functionality and subtlety that comes with Deep Glow. In the effect controls, let's cut the radius down to 250 and lower the exposure down to about 0.9. Next, we'll go back and search for invert and apply it onto our footage. After that, let's also add the tint effect and change our whites to a more subtle light bluish color depending on how vivid you want your effect to look and this creates a quick and easy x-ray effect now if you're happy with your results already go ahead and export your project however if you want more options to spice up your x-ray edit I do have a thermal LUT pack that I've pre-built entirely from scratch in this pack I have a wide variety of infrared looks that will give you much more than just the x-ray aesthetic as you can see these thermal LUTs will provide much more character and authenticity to your edit I'll add a link at the top of the description along with some other editing assets you might enjoy using and I'll throw in a $5 discount using the code THERMAL5. Now once you do get this pack I recommend looking for the following LUTs as they resemble closely to the x-ray medical aesthetic that you won't really find anywhere else. To add this go ahead and search for Lumetri Color and in effect controls go to creative and click on browse. There you will want to locate your thermal LUTs and select a LUT that feels best and instantly you will have something truly special. You know you could customize the basic correction to your liking and once you export and see the final results you will be left with a simple but amazing edit. I hope you found this tutorial helpful, if it did be sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video, peace.